Welcome to Celebrating Act 2. Celebrating Act 2 is the user manual for the second half of your life. Welcome back, everybody. I'm here with John Cohen, my amazing partner. Uh, I am amazing, you, aren't I? You are. You are absolutely amazing. <laughs> and um, it's great to see you all. Thank you all for joining us again. It's always uh, great to have your company. Um, I, Art, I want to talk about variety today. And really? I don't mean you're, not talking, you're not talking about spices of life? <laughs> it's a, it is a spice of life. Oh. And I, I really want to talk to our audience because I think many of you um, watch our videos. How many do we put out a week, Art? Seven or, or eight yeah. a, a week? Uh, they watch our videos because they're mostly our uh, nine or ten experts, mm -hmm. um, and and they obviously our experts contribute two, three, sometimes four a month um, videos, and so you might get the impression that we're all about these same nine or ten people giving you uh, advice, whether it's John Mariani on food and travel, or Dr. Liz on health, or. Uh, uh, Give me some others, Art. Who are some? Well, more I'll, I'll give you one that was actually a one-off that turned out to be a regular. Steve Campbell. Uh, thank the, you, Steve brain Campbell, whisperer. the Brain Whisperer. Yeah, yeah. I, we so we I, had one great interview with him, and um, then it turned into well, let's do a series of four because he has a whole uh, uh, thing that he does out on the road, and then it was just so fascinating. We said, well, can we break them up into these little things? about how you can you, you can talk your mind into uh, doing stuff you wanted to do rather than what he wants to do. So, right. uh, yeah, so well, he's one. Yeah, and, uh, you know, the same thing happened with Donna Lynn Polito. Hmm. Uh, we found this lady who specializes in exercise and uh, nutrition for people over 50, and uh, we did this great interview with her, and we said, Donna Lynn, you know, can you give us these tips? Now she's doing them weekly for us. Hmm. We call them short and sweet. Um, so my point is that we do, what do we, Art, you and I call them one-offs. We just interview somebody right. who's fascinating, who's interesting, who's got something we can learn from. And, uh, sometimes they become regulars, but sometimes they don't. Yeah, well, I'll and, give you a perfect uh, example of one that, that, uh, he's actually one of our more popular ones going back several years, Darren Baker, who does Living Trust. And, right. in, and in fact, he was thinking about retiring, but he, he virtually does everything over the phone anyway. And uh, I uh, checked uh, back with him literally about uh, three weeks ago, and he's still doing these living trusts. Uh, he's, a, he's a, an attorney, uh, but he does it really nicely for around 600 bucks. He gives you a printout with it. He, yep. he j That's all he does. And uh, he doesn't charge extra for the uh, notary because his wife does all that stuff when you come in to finally finish it up. So he's a one-off, but his, his information is uh, timeless, fairly. But, it is timeless, yeah. yeah. And and uh, and you're right. We did we did that one video with him, and it's up there. You can watch it anytime. I don't know how old it is. It's only mm. a year, or, what two years old maybe. Right. Um, but it's timeless information for trusts, right. for people over fifty or under fifty, for that matter, to have a good trust uh, instead of a will. Yeah. Um, Coming up soon is Anne Ganguza, mm. and uh, nobody's seen it yet because we haven't posted it, but we'll probably post it next week. And Anne is a professional voiceover coach and artist, uh, entertainer, and, um, narrator. But what we interviewed her about was the fact that she moved into an over 50 community. And uh, we thought that was fascinating. She was just 55. No, she just turned 50, I think just became legal, but her husband was over 55. Right, when they, so, when they bought it a couple of years ago because it was being built. So they, they could quote, they, they were legal to move into an over 55 community. Right. But, you know, it, we thought it was interesting for you, the viewer, to, to learn about over 55 communities. What are they really like? I remember for years driving by uh, these places saying, oh, that's for old people. That's a retirement home, you know, but they're not like that at all. So our interview with Anne is a lot of fun. And we also had, uh, we had a, a one-off uh, Vince McCullough. Uh, we and interviewed Vince him about uh, Tai Chi, and uh, I think he was about 85 at the time. And yes. uh, he talked about why Tai Chi is, is so good for 
of people who want to just keep active and moving for their entire lives. Um, yeah, and now, of course, he just passed away uh, a, a month or two ago he, at 90. Right. Uh, but what a fascinating character. Certainly worth uh, your time to watch the video that we did with him. Two or three videos, actually. So um, the point is, we're not just about the same nine people giving you advice on, I think, pretty important topics. Um, we also have lots of new stuff, and they're about life. And one of the just really the most important things for everybody is that whether it's a one-off or one of our series, both of us, adorable, the two of us adorable people are always <laughs> there uh, having the conversations that we know that you love to have as well. So, uh, by the way, if you do uh, know somebody or you yourself uh, have something uh, interesting you wanted to share, uh, let us know. And uh, maybe you'll be a one-off, or maybe you'll just be a repeat customer. By the way, another one, another really great person that we spoke to uh, recently was uh, Lindell, Lindell Stonick, uh, an art teacher. Yes. Yes. Just, uh, she's uh, one, one of the more popular uh, individual ones that we've done. And she hasn't even spread it out yet because she hasn't even back to school, even though we've published it. So there's just yeah. lots of interesting people with interesting stories about what they're doing in their second act. And good ideas for you. For your second act so please watch please subscribe and watch every video that comes out you never know when you get a new one for more on celebrating act two visit our webpage follow us on facebook subscribe to us on youtube and tell your friends celebrating act two is the user manual for the second half of your life